Yeah, I'm sorry I asked those guys to stay because I didn't, didn't expect for them to have to stay this long. Um, but I did want to ask, as I was talking to Nancy Stiles, and she uh, was talking about these signs, and I know that she mentioned them to I you, Fred. I think they're right? great. Yeah. And uh, basically, um, I, from talking to um, Chuck and Dean, that there, nothing was really adopted. It was just a, dis uh, a discussion. Um, yeah, come on up here. Uh, the red one, which really looks good, is evidently copyrighted. It can't be used. You can't use uh, Clifford yeah, the Big Red Dog. Yeah, because that was the one I liked, too. I didn't. Who is he? Clifford the Big Red Dog. And what does he do? Um, Clifford. Cartoon. He's oh, a cartoon. 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 Yeah. Yeah, he would cost us a lot of money. <laughs> yeah. so. uh, I guess just for the record, I, I'm Dean Merrill. Um, I'm the vice chair of the Hampton Beach Commission. And, and Chuck is a uh, representative on the commission for the Hampton Beach Village okay. District. So um, maybe. I'm going to go off side a little bit here because you're talking about that meeting. Um, yeah. The meeting is all set. Uh, we're just starting in the planning cages. I, to the extent of, of people that are going to be notified, um, we're, we've already got in wheels uh, motions um, to be have things posted here. It's going to be posted uh, on the chamber website. There's going to be direct mailings going out. And the there's also going to be website. two or three people knocking on doors uh, down in the beach area. Um, to make people aware because we want to get a good crowd there mm -hmm. and basically the the meeting will be done by the state as, as Fred has mentioned is it um, it's a transportation section um, but they'll be there with an overhead and they're going to have tables with, with the whole schematic so you can look at them wow. closely so um, they've done, done a lot of work after the input then the commissioners will decide on the different plans which direction we want to go in and, uh, so the more input we have. Um, so we're going to try everything possible to, uh, to get the word out to, you know, not have two or three people there, but as many as uh, it's an opportunity for the public and, and uh, um, the, the op, you know, the police and the fire and whatever to take a look at it too. Mm -hmm. so. So, so the signage, the signage. Yeah. Um, we talked to uh, Mike Hausman, who's from yeah. the state, mm -hmm. yeah. and uh, they have their the glass, how the glass signage on the beach. Uh, he's going to look into having allowing us to put signage there, mm -hmm. and the village district is going to look into signage and possibly have um, the beach businesses, um, uh, uh, you know, push for yeah, keeping like the beach in, clean. Yeah, like the places and that for people maybe like do not litter for places that are. Uh, where a lot of the litter originates or something like that. So this is a work in progress that is um, going on. Um, and uh, I'm not sure. Uh, in Hampton, Fred, is there an ordinance for a $100 first offense for do not litter? Hmm. We have a, a, a almost a death penalty ordinance for littering. <laughs> yeah. And, and we'd like to keep it that way so people will obey it. Yeah. And there is a very high fine. It runs yeah. up to $500 for a third offense. But what was the last time we gave up a thousand dollar fine? Haven't. Yeah, we, we, we haven't. haven't. That's exactly my point. These litters, uh, these yeah. litters, these signs, um, they're pretty hard to like. The police don't run and go after them when there's a hundred dollar first offense or a five hundred second offense. Although we have to hope that everyone wants to do the right thing, and that's where the power of these signs are. And. Um, you know, it's the same thing uh, nationwide with the gun control and all. You have to always hope that people are going to do the right thing. Yeah. And I think that's why when we heard from Anthony that was here tonight that wants to have no smoking at the beach, where many other people feel the same way and nobody wants the cigarette butts put out into the sand. I think that for the two beaches that we have, we could easily put up a sign, maybe one that says not to litter either. Uh, also, the whole state has gone uh, all over the state. They don't do it in Hampton anymore that says, please carry out what you've carried in. But I've seen them all up in um, uh, the Kangamangas uh, Highway and all of that. They're everywhere. And I'm sure that they don't throw people in jail either. Uh, and the, there's no one police enforcing it. So I would like to make a motion now that we put up some signs that I, the word I thought of earlier is policy. Not that it's an ordinance. You know, the Hampton has a policy of no smoking in the beach. That's very similar to there's a policy of no smoking in this building. 
and many other buildings that the town has. Do, I, I don't know if we allow smoking in the fire department uh, allow smoking or the police in, department. No smoking within public buildings, no smoking within public vehicles. Excellent. Mm -hmm. And you, yes, you can be arrested for that if, yeah. if it's a ser so serious enough offense. I think that we could afford just two signs. The will of the people definitely overwhelmingly asked for this no smoking and I think the price of two signs and just hope that people do the right thing hope they're not carrying guns to the beach either but you know <laughs> you have to hope that people are doing gonna do the right thing Those sharks are dangerous. so I'd like my motion to be that Hampton put up two signs at our town beaches that say that we have a policy of no smoking on public town beaches what about the litter yeah can we add litter well to we it? could do litter too yeah. no smoking or litter Wait, I'll second that in open for discussion okay, yeah. okay. What, what did the article say an ordinance or I've got it right here what did it say it probably does say ordinance but the I'm end. asking for well, something I'm different just wondering what it said first yeah. of all it's it's, way at the end right? yeah I just had it here because yeah. um, I'm under 44 order. or yeah. something like that yeah it says um, that's Sonny Kravitz uh, yeah. It was right in there. Maybe it's the next. Yeah, it's. I think it's very short. Is that it, right there? Second for, uh, from the bottom. No. Yeah. It's oh, right yeah, it is. End. Yes. To to the selectmen of Hampton, the undersigned legal voters of the town of Hampton request that you insert in the warrant article, uh, warrant for the next town meeting the following: prohibits smoking on all town beaches in Hampton. Yeah. I would just like to say that we have a policy of no smoking, mm -hmm. and I think that they'll be happy with that. And, uh, you know, that way it doesn't put any burden on the police. And I'll tell you, even those news reporters, they were all thinking, this is really good. And the fact that they played it for four days as part of their news, I think it says something. My sister saw it in Florida. Oh. So it, somehow somebody picked it up and took it on to another ABC station. ABC or NBC, NBC picked it up, yeah. yeah. We didn't break the camera? No. <laughs> Rusty, you look better than me. That's what I didn't care for. Um, no, so... Uh, you know, I, that's my motion. All right. So we, we have, have a first, a second. A second. A second yeah. All those in favor? Thank Unanimous. you. Thank you. I hope we get it. It's going to make Hampton Beach better all the way around. Oh, okay. I'm not finished with my old business yet. Good. How we were talking on the signs, can uh, can we also look at putting the, the dog waste signs along with the bags down there like the state has? Yeah, each one take of, them into the water time, but use yeah. each one of the entrances yeah. down there. They have the bag. They have the signs with the bags. Right. And we have stuff the same signs, same bags. Encourage yeah. them. I think we we need to have those at both. The, yeah. All, we should have it at all, all of our parks, not only just our be our beaches, but yeah. we should have them at the parks also. Yes. Yeah. That yeah. was part of what I was being consistent that we use these. Fred, Nancy did talk with Fred. Okay. Yeah, about yeah. it. Now, please, may we, Rick is talking signs tonight, so I will too. May we have appropriate signs placed at White's Lane and Jaunty's Lane telling the individuals to come in there, who come in there, that there will be no shooting in the town forest. Also, you might put something on about littering because those fools that were in there shooting left their shell casings and littered all over the place. Yeah. So, uh, but, but I think the signs need to be updated, if you'd be so kind. See, it's all Rick's fault, because he's doing signs, too. <laughs> 